This is my version of Lyman's filament extruder. Most of the design is Lyman's with a few minor changes. Most of the changes are in the mount plates and the sprockets. All of my sheet steel pieces are laser cut, which includes the mounts, thrust plate, and also the sprockets. The only 3D printed part is the hopper. The temperature controller reads a thermistor and signals to turn on the heat band as needed based on the temperature reading and temperature setting. This view shows the custom sprockets. I didn't like the idea of using plastic sprockets, printed or otherwise, and I wasn't happy with the bicycle sprockets that I had found. I designed my own for the project and had them laser cut from steel, just like the mounting brackets. The small sprocket has a piece of wiper drive link welded to the motor facing side to mount to the motor's tapered spline. The large sprocket has a hex cut specifically to drive this auger bit. There is a shaft collar welded to the other side of the sprocket to help it stay perpendicular to the auger shaft. The back panel arrangement is slightly different than the standard design in that I used a metal enclosed DC power converter instead of a laptop power supply. The adjustable power converter to the left controls the motor speed. The white block in the middle is a solid state relay used to apply power to the heat band. The black block to the right is a temperature controller which reads the thermistor and applies power to the heat band depending on the set temperature and the present temperature. 